morning, good afternoon, good evening, traders from across the globe, and welcome to the 1067th edition of Short Term Trading Live with Oscar Carboni, and that would be me. Good evening, traders. This video is being filmed on Monday Night for Trading Tuesday. That would be August 27, 2013. Traders, before we get into this, future trading, as we know, can be extremely and is extremely risky and can cause substantial financial loss. Future trading is not suitable for all trading accounts. Always place your stops first. A stop can be your best friend. Traders, what's on the board? Let's get right into it. There is a red omni on the board. The market came off a little bit today. And traders, my goodness, today on TV land, they tried everything. They threw everything, including the kitchen sink at us, to call this move that started today some sort of a crash, the beginning of the next big crash. Look out, it's 1929. They were going nuts on TV today. Did you hear them? They tried everything from the fiscal cliff, which isn't until mid-October, right? Here we are in August. This is mid-October. They started on, maybe it's the fiscal cliff. Then they went to, oh no, and the Fed's running out of cash. That's why we went down today. Well, you know what? The Fed running out of cash is tied to that same event in mid-October. So wait, that wasn't it. Then they went to the Syrian nerve gas extravaganza going on in the Middle East. They tried everything to stir up the goblins today and get us scared. And I'm here to tell you this, traders. There's nothing else going on except for an Oscarism. Holiday reversals are abound. You traders who know me for a long time, you Omniacs who have been following me for years, you know that you knew this video was coming out today, right? Holiday reversals are abound. Traders, if you don't know what that means, it is an Oscarism proved to be a truism year after year after year. And that is this. If you are in a market that's generally been in a bull market for quite some time and you start leaning into a three-day holiday weekend in the United States, the week leading into a Friday, Saturday, Sunday off or a Saturday, Sunday, Monday off, a three-day weekend, you find reversals come out of nowhere in many markets. And then as soon as we get out, it basically as soon as we get out of the holiday or when we get up to the holiday, the reversals go away as if they never happened. So I say number three, you keep your blinders on till the holiday passes. Now traders, this holiday is huge. It is the end of the summer. Every trader I've ever known that can goes out of the uh, out of town, goes up to the they go up to the mountains to their shore homes. They uh, they. They go up to the mountains, to the mountain homes. They go down to the shore, to their shore homes. They go out to the suburbs of Chicago. They go to the lakes. They go Yosemite Park, even while it's burning. They go everywhere. But where they aren't is sitting at their trading desks this week. Now, I'm sure that's the phenomenon that creates the reversal. But I'm not here to question why it happens. I know it happens. I warn you about it all the time. And I'm here to say this. Because there are so few traders out there trading, you should just take the next few days and go enjoy yourself. Smell the roses. I'll be here. I'll be belting out a trade now and then for you Omniacs, but official Omnis probably stop after tomorrow night's trading because we're getting too close to the holiday. You should heed that advice and go enjoy yourself for a couple of days. All right, traders, listen to this. We have some great things on the board. I will show you the holiday reversals. It looks like ES, NASDAQ, and the Dow are likely to head lower, at least for Tuesday. And keep your blinders on all the way through the next 10 days because what's going to happen before your eyes is likely not what September has going forward after about week one September. So traders, the Red Omni says we're going down. Be careful. Be very, very nimble like you've seen us do today. You Omniacs that followed me today, we got in. The market rallied 10 points. We got out and we were finished and we stepped aside because this is late August. And I am telling you to heed these warnings. Holiday reversals, very thin markets, 31st year traders. I'm not making this stuff up on the fly. So if you like these videos and if you like the analysis, I am about to show you in the chart segment in a moment. Come on down to livewithoscar.com and subscribe to my site and or 
go to youtube.com forward slash futures analysts. If you go there and subscribe to my videos at YouTube, you will get an email every time I put one out. Traders, with no further ado, let's go look at some charts. Traders, Oscar Carboni is holding another OmniCamp live in Las Vegas. OmniCamp is an intensive four-day course taught by the Wall Street whiz Oscar Carboni himself. Oscar has been analyzing markets and trading commodities on and off the New York trading pits for over 30 years. Trading for a living is a very difficult business. Oscar will simplify the process so that you can easily understand and analyze the markets. Classes are limited. For more information, call 702-629-4755. Our phones are staffed 24-7. Futures trading is risky and can cause substantial financial loss. Trading futures is not suitable for all accounts. Traders, holiday reversals are abound in Oscarism. Dow Jones Industrial Average weekly bar chart, meaning each one of these green lines represents one full week's worth of trading. These weekly charts show you trend direction. Traders, weekly chart has been inside of this blue channel for quite some time and bullish. And we've got this red support line, which was breached. And here we are right before the holiday. We're below the support line, showing us that the market wants to go lower. That's the weekly showing the holiday reversal. I'm going to blow this up for you right now, traders. The Dow Jones Industrial Average blown that chart up a little bit for you and went to it daily. We were looking at a weekly. I went to it daily. The daily shows you the same sort of thing going on. The red support has been breached and is now literally resistance if you get back up there. Then I'm literally going to blow up this chart, the daily. I'm going to zoom in on this daily for you right now. I want you to take a look at this, traders. When you zoom in on that daily, you are below that support line, which is now resistance. But look what it morphed into. It is a bear flag right there before your eyes. So the Dow Jones Industrial Average absolutely has a bear flag. This is perfect timing for the holiday reversal. Down we should go off of that flag. That makes sense to me. But remember, keep your blinders on because this will dissipate and will head right back up when the holiday reversal is through. So then we've got the NASDAQ traders. Holiday reversals are abound. Look at that NASDAQ. A big, big, ugly reversal bar takes place on Monday. Right on time for the holiday reversals. Looks to me like we spend some time on the downside Tuesday. Traders, these are the charts I wanted to show you. I hope that these charts are helping to keep you in tune with market movement. Do your own charts. Do your own analysis. Come on down to LiveWithOscar.com and let's compare notes. You will find me there every day. So, traders, you've seen the charts, and there is my technical argument for why the reversals are coming in. The holiday reversals, do not forget them. Traders, nimble, 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 nimble is what you need to be if you're going to continue trading for the rest of this week. This, the rest of this month, I guess, is only the end of the week, but the rest of this month will be treacherous for traders. If you're with me in the chat room, I will be putting out trades after tomorrow in the chat room, but probably not sending out official Omnis, so you got to be there if you'd like to be part of it. Traders, Omni Camp, September 27th through the 30th. It is a Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. If you'd like to join me at Omni Camp, there's a couple of seats still open. Come to LiveOscar.com, fill out your applications, and I'll call you. And because Vince picked up the T-shirt, I guess I'll have a contest tomorrow. There you go. One way to get the Omniacs involved. Traders, Omni T-shirts will be given out at the site tomorrow. You come on down to LiveOscar.com. I will give you a shirt that says Stops Are In, Emotions Are Out, the Omni Trading Academy on the front. You can win these shirts by calling the close to the NASDAQ or whatever it is I deem that I ask you for. So come on down to Live Alaska and win yourselves a shirt. All right, traders, I'm out of here. Always remember to keep your emotions out of trading. One of the best things you can do to help yourselves with that is say this to yourselves every morning, every afternoon, every evening, and you know what that is.
reversals are abound. Futures trading is risky and can cause substantial financial loss. We do not claim or guarantee that you will profit from the information provided. 